destroyer blade has got to be my favorite weapon mod because once you learn how to use it properly the more annoying demons become trivial and it also has the best charge up sound so in this video i want to share some tips to help you use this mod and the best demons to use it against Using this mod bare bones will burn through your ammo fast, so it's important to get the incremental blades. Each charge of the incremental blade consumes different amounts of ammo, but the first charge is definitely the most useful, as it only consumes 16 energy compared to the 25 of the base ballista shot does, and it does far more damage. The main reason why some players would stay away from the destroyer blade is how much it slows you down, as staying still in this game means certain death. But what some players don't know is that you can keep your momentum jumping and charging at the same time, allowing you to charge and move around the level. To do this, just time your jump as soon as you touch the ground and repeat. If you're going to charge your blade, just make sure you're airborne first, just in case you need to get around the level. Now back on the topic of the incremental blades, this really changes how you would use this weapon. This mod is the most useful against carcasses, maker drones, vector whips, and demon turrets. It can break through the shield of a carcass and continue forward to kill the demon. As for the maker drones, it can be difficult to land headshots on them, but thankfully the blade makes it easier since the hitbox on the blade is quite large. Spectre whips are difficult since you can't lock onto them with rockets for an instant kill, but charging up to the second increment can stagger whiplashes, which is perfect since you don't need to be precise with a destroyer blade. And as you know, demon turrets can be pretty annoying, especially in this fight with the Marauder and Ancient Gods. But using the second increment can instantly kill a turret. Those are the most notable, but here is a quick list of demons for each increment that can be staggered and killed. I left out some of the heavier demons like the tyrants that it takes more to bring them down. So I hope this video helps you decide to use a blade more often. It's not the beast it was in 2016 but should be respected in its own way. Anyways I have some more videos in the pipeline like why I prefer a controller over a mouse and keyboard. Um, so if you enjoyed subscribe for more content and see y'all in the next one. Laters.